small. That little kiddo, though, could not have pulled it off cuter. I know. That little giggle where you can see he's like, play cool. I'm fine. <laughs> and then you can just see, water like, water. the tears, yeah. like, the eyes. Like, yeah, I'm sure that makes every mom want to cry. Oh, yeah. It'll be for a short time, but these are little life steps, you know, too. Yeah. Oh, I for sure. Yeah. I bawled. I guarantee you his mom cried more when she left. <laughs> oh, I know. I know. Oh, sweet. Well, hopefully he's loving kindergarten this morning. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get started with a look at that forecast. We'll begin with the travel forecast. For those of you heading out of the state lines this morning, you'll notice a dark green color out here across the mid-Atlantic. That's where we expect some of the stronger storms to fire. Here in New Mexico, we just have a general risk of a few spot storms out over the mountain areas. Heading into tomorrow, marginal risk gets closer to us out in far western Kansas, parts of the Oklahoma Panhandle and West Texas. But by Saturday, we get the slight risk going for parts of the northern plains and Midwest. Here in New Mexico, general risk of some thunderstorms. I'm not thinking anything severe, but at least we're talking rain chances again, right? Doppler radar this morning showing a good amount of cloud cover out across the eastern plains. Seeing some high clouds out in the foothills over us here in the metro area, but nothing is falling from those clouds. No major storms or showers out there by any means. Temps this morning in the 40s, up in Taos, 37, the cold spot in Alamosa. We're getting closer to fall, guys, in those 60s and 70s out across the southern portions of the state. So maybe a light jacket for some. We're actually cooler this morning in most areas compared to yesterday. We're down a good 8 degrees in Farmington, 11 degrees cooler in TRC right now, and even 4 degrees cooler in Clovis. So cooler start, but a warmer afternoon. We're going to flip that trend around heading into this afternoon. Wind speeds, at least the winds are better as well. Yesterday, we saw some gusty winds waking up and walking out the door. At this point, it's just a light breeze in some areas. The highest wind speed I see is 14 miles per hour in Las Vegas, and even that's not bad. Hourly forecast for us here in the Duke City. We can plan on temperatures topping out in the low to mid-90s today. More cloud cover as we head towards this afternoon, but I'm not thinking anything significant in the way of the storm chances. Eastern Plains, despite that nice comfy day in the 60s and 70s you had yesterday, we're bringing back the warm-up. 80s expected in Las Vegas and Chicken Carry, upper 80s to low 90s over the southeast. Farmington topping out at 88. So, super storm track heading into this afternoon. Spot storms out over the higher terrain. It's really not going to be a lot, though. Coverage just not impressive with today's setup here. But at least rain chances are trending upwards. That's something we're going to keep in mind here for today. We're looking at mostly to partly sunny skies across the state. Similar day tomorrow, but by this weekend, we'll start to shake things up a bit. Got a cold front moving in, some monsoonal moisture to tap into. That will actually help get our rain chances up statewide. Southern Colorado, partly sunny as well, which is why my hair is so big this morning. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, at least I'm happy to see the rain chances back. In the forecast, I was gonna for say, sure. Here, here comes the monsoon season again, right? <laughs> yeah, a little bit of monsoon moisture. These cold fronts don't get stronger. We're yeah. getting closer yeah. to the next season. So deal. I guess we'll deal with your your big hair as long as we get I, some rain. Something right. is happening on this side. Like I, it, I, I tried, even guys. See you around. I'm just. Kidding. I know it, it's a little like a bubble. <laughs> you look fine. This is just some day, you know. <laughs> I know. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Kristen.